Hey guys, it's Ashlyn. So today's video, I'm going to be doing like a get ready with me because I'm not actually like getting ready for anything. I just wanted to do like do my makeup. So, oh, that's going to bother me. I hope you like my outfit. I was wearing a t-shirt and shorts and then I was like, maybe I should like wear an actual like shirt. Anyways, I'm going to be doing my makeup because I feel like it and it's been a hot minute since I've actually like sat down and done my makeup. My eyebrows look pretty thick and just like not good, but... Oh well, honestly, let's just let, let's just let, let's just get into it. So, gonna start out with eyes. So I'm, I'm gonna like talk through kind of what I'm doing, but it's like not really gonna be a tutorial, but like kind of a tutorial, but like kind of just we're gonna talk. I don't really know. I also don't really know what to talk about, but it's all right. <sighs> I'm out of breath. Okay, I've already done like base makeup pretty much. It kind of looks bad. Um, and my, I've also done my eyebrows and I just look really weird right now. So we're just, we just need to get on with it. So the eyeshadow palette I'm going to use is the Sorme Treatment Cosmetics eyeshadow palette. It is so beautiful. This was sent to me through Octoly. So thank you so much to Sorme for sending me this. Um, and I used this before. I actually filmed this video yesterday, but it was at my vanity and it was such a bad video. Like, I'm just not, we're, we're not going to talk about it. So the first color I'm going to take is this shade right there. It's like a cool toned type of color. Also, the lighting is pretty bad right now. Like the sun is like pretty much down. So if this doesn't turn out that good, I'm very sorry. Also, this look you could do for homecoming because like I'm going to not make it like super duper natural, obviously, because it's like a makeup look and I haven't done a makeup look in a while. So like you could do this for homecoming it doesn't match my dress that i'm going to be wearing but like this is a definitely a look that i would consider if it actually matched my dress but it doesn't i love this eyeshadow palette so much it's really good next i'm gonna go in with that brown shade you can see me and i'm going to put that on my outer corner in my crease this look i've done three times already because i did it for fun and i didn't expect it to turn out and then I did it last night, and then I'm doing it again. So, yeah, I really do like this look, though, and this palette is also super good. Before I ordered this palette off of Octoly, I've never heard of the brand, and I'm so glad that I have now because all their stuff comes in super cute, like, packaging, like, box-wise. Like, when you open it up, you think it's, like, super cute. Because I have another thing that I'm going to include in the video later, so you'll see. I'm going to do one eye at a time so I can, like, pause the video while I do my other eye but yeah it looks like this right now but next I'm gonna take this dark brown shade right there and I'm going to put it on my on like the very outer part of my eye and like kind of work it into the crease but like not really I feel like I'm really far away from you guys I should be like right here but I have a Christmas tree box right in front of my knees so the key to good eyeshadow honestly is just blending like you don't want harsh lines because then your eyeshadow would not look good so just blend okay i feel like that's a little bit better i'm going to get concealer i just stepped on my shoe i feel like i just have a lot of energy right now i i'm gonna use my elf concealer my lid broke but it still works it's okay and i'm going to do a half cut crease and i'm going to use a brush from this this was also sent to me through Octoly, so thank you so much to Morocco's Makeup for sending this to me. Super duper good. I love the packaging. Also, it is an anti, like, it's like an antibacterial brush set. It's super cool. And I'm going to take this brush from the set. I'll try to use as many brushes as I can from the set so you guys can actually, like, see what it's like. But yeah, also, this palette comes with a really nice mirror. So, that's also good. <laughs> I just did a half cut crease so fast. Anyways, next I'm going to put on my lid shade. So honestly, you could leave it like that if you wanted it to be a matte look, but I want to add some pizzazz to it. So I'm gonna use this gold shade. Like, look how ready. Just saying. So I'm gonna just pack it on, but like you literally don't even need that much because, as you could t tell super nice okay then i'm going to take this brush it's also br from the brand maracas makeup but it's from a different brush set also sent to me through octoly so 
again thank you <laughs> um but this is the stiletto's essential eye brush kit it comes with this brush which is just like a, a shader brush and then this fluffy crease brush and a dual ended eyebrow brush that comes with a spoolie and then a super nice little brush and then this brush which would also be good for like concealer carving eyebrows blending the concealer on your eyelids i'm just going to add more of this brown shade and just kind of blend the shimmer with the matte and then i'm going to take just my fluffy brush that i use the transition shade with and go back into the transition shade and blend everything out all right and i'm not feeling eyeliner or lashes today so i'm just gonna do mascara later so i'm gonna do the other eye and i'll be back okay, cool we're gonna pretend this uh lighting looks good but it doesn't so i just did the other eye also i forgot to mention that this is the a scented hues eyeshadow palette the warm hues eyeshadow palette so it'll be in the description next i'm gonna go on to face this is another product from Sorme. this isn't sponsored like i'm giving my honest opinions but um this was also sent to me through octoly but it came in a big like brown box you know and then it came with this and then it came with a uh, handwritten note which is always super duper nice i love when companies do this it comes with the product Ooh. comes with the product and then the inside but this is the sorme treatment cosmetics professional contour and strobing kit and when you open it up it looks like this it's just kind of like the same style of packaging as the eyeshadow palette when you open it up it looks like this i've already used it and i love it but i literally just got it today but it comes with a banana setting shade which is what i set my face with today and then a more cool tone contour shade and a more of a warmer tone bronzer shade and then a highlighter and the highlighter is like nice it's more natural but it's nice if you're looking for a natural highlight it's like perfect for school so i'm just gonna tear this thing off so i'm gonna use this brush from this kit it's just like a tapered fluffy brush i'm gonna just mix this in the shade and it comes with a good amount of product on it and then just bronze up my face i've never used this brush for bronzing but okay as you can tell just added a nice like warmth to my face which i definitely needed then i'm going to do a little contour with my nose with this shade I'm going to use this brush. This might not be the brush to use for nose contour, but I'm going to try it. It's from this set. I pretty much never do this, but might as well just go for it today. Okay, I feel like that's not, like, terrible, but it's definitely my fault for not doing it great. Next, I'm going to do blush. I'm going to use the Tarte blush in the shade Party. I'm just going to use this brush from the Morocco's makeup set. I don't know if I'm saying this right, but... Um, this is a great blush. I feel like it's been so long since I've done one of these types of videos. Like, just where I sit down and do my makeup. It, it, it's been so long. Yeah, I'm using natural light right now. So, this is probably not the greatest idea. But, I'm going to use highlighters. So, uh, there's not, like, a great highlighting brush. But, you know, I'm just going to use the one that we use for nose contour. And then just use this maybe for highlighter. This is just the kind of like fluffy crease brush. It's kind of big for my eye, but anyways, I'm going to use it for highlighter right now. Really, really subtle glow, but it's really pretty. And then I'm just going to use my finger and then take it on my nose. I'm going to use the brush that comes with the eyeshadow palette. It has a sponge tip on one side and then um, this an actual, actually nice brush on this other side. And I'm just going to take the highlight shade and just... Highlight my inner corners. Actually, I'm gonna be using this shade from the eyeshadow palette. That makes more sense. And also some on my brow bone. Okay. <laughs> and then I need to put some eyeshadow on my lower lash line. So I'm just gonna take like that shade and that shade one at a time and just put it on my lower lash line. I was gonna talk more in this video, but then I realized I don't really have much to talk about. Oh yeah, I am gonna do a homecoming video. I'm so excited for it. Like I'm so excited for homecoming, like, no joke, actually, so excited, but, yeah, I'm gonna do homecoming, like, get ready with me, and I 
and like it was, I'm, I'm happy to do that video like I'm just I'm real excited and my dress I'm getting it altered and just like the straps and it's literally getting done the day before homecoming which homecoming for me is September 21st so I don't know why it's gonna take her that long but I'm trusting her to get it done on time anyways I'm gonna curl my eyelashes and then add mascara and the mascara I'm using is the Too Faced BTS mascara. I need to get a new one of these because both of mine are like getting dried out. So that's not good. This eyeshadow look would be super pretty with like some winged eyeliner. But I just wasn't feeling it today. Also, I love this mascara. And I like, don't really feel like doing lips. But I guess I will just like to finish off the look. So I need to grab it. Okay, the lip I'm gonna be using is one that I got in last month's boxy charm. By the way, this month's boxy charm kind of sucked, but oh well. But I'm gonna use the Smashbox Always On Liquid Lipstick in the shade Stay Neutral. This does not like to come off, so I'm gonna regret using this because it's like just a pain to get off. It like won't really come off in the shower. So yeah, but it's okay. It's for a video. It's all right. This actually goes pretty decently well with the look. Well, that made the look look really different. Okay. Lips can either make or break the look, and I feel like with this, it kind of broke the look, but it's all right. Maybe it'll, like, grow on me. I don't really know. This is the final look. My hair looks disgusting because I had softball after school, and then, like, yeah. But, whoa. Eek. But this is the final look. It's not, like, amazing, but it's, like, fine, I guess. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, Don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Make sure to comment, like, subscribe, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!